Hi guys, it's Frankie, and in today's video, I will be making cinnamon buns or cinnamon swirls with puff pastry. So I'm gonna get that, and then we'll get started. Okay, so I've got the puff pastry right here, and it runs out in ages, so that's fine. And all you need is puff pastry, cinnamon, and sugar, or if you're making chocolate, you can do Nutella, whatever. But I like cinnamon as well, so I'm going to make them. I can find cinnamon. This takes forever, there's like 20 seasonings in this cupboard. Paprika, that's like all there is in it. Paprika, nobody ever knows. Cinnamon, there you go. Cinnamon. I think I might need the old one too. There's barely any in there. Yeah, there's two. And, oh, let me pull this stuff back. Wait there, guys. Okay, so we've got the cinnamon, we've got the sugar behind the camera. I can't take it out because it's leaning on it. Well, I can, I don't do that. I've got the sugar in it. I'll keep that to the side. Okay, so let's get started. So you want to open this up, take it out. Okay, so you want to start by unraveling the puff pastry make sure you clean your hands beforehand i already have and yeah so once you've got this done you want to get a bit of butter that's what you need butter can i use a knife or a spoon I'm going to use a spoon because then it won't be the pastry. So I'll just grab it on the front of the spoon, make it softer. I know this might seem strange, but yeah, that's all you have to do. So basically, you just spread the butter out as much as you can. And then so it can stick the cinnamon sugar if you like or if you didn't know okay okay so you want to try and get that all over and i'll be right back okay once you've done that you want to preheat the oven to 220 and you want to just leave that until you've finished so now you want to get the sugar first, I would probably say. So it's like, yeah. So you just want to sprinkle the sugar all over. Try and make it even as you can. Like you can layer it as you go. Like sugar cinnamon, sugar cinnamon. Well, it depends if you're sweet too. Just a bit more here, and then we'll go on to the cinnamon. Okay, so I'm going to start the new cinnamon. Well, I think I put a little bit. So, I'm going to put more sugar a bit. You know, like that. Put the lid back. Put that back. Don't even put any here, so I'm going to do that. Okay, so once you've done that, you want to turn it long ways or whatever way you want. Just fold it with your fingers, just like that, for a second. Then with the rest, you want to fold it and push. Try, or if it gets stuck like mine just did, just roll it yourself. Try and do it tight so none of the fillings fall out. Because I've done that last time and I think I'm going to do it again. Be right back. Okay, so once you've done that, you want to 
push it together so none of it falls out and then you want to get a knife and cut it into equal parts. I'm recording for YouTube. Just like that and keep them to the side. I'm gonna make tiny little ones. So you got those. Look how tiny. That's so cute. They usually come out big, but for some reason. No, they they used to come out big, didn't they? No, yeah, they do. They swell up, don't they? No, look. Look how tiny they are. I don't care. At least they're tiny ones, ain't it? I'll be right back once I've cut them. Okay, so I've cut them all up into these tiny little cinnamon ones. And you can push them together if they're not staying. So I'm just going to quickly push them together so now the cinnamon and sugar comes out well some of it has but that's fine and I left the tray in there it's amazing ain't it okay so you want to get your pan and you want to place all of your little cinnamons on there or chocolate or whatever and cook them for 12 minutes or what the packet says be right back so if you wait till the time as soon as it switches and put them in then that's much better than you get perfect oh. time yeah I've had it on for a minute okay so once it turns to 51 past I'm going to put them in and then in 12 minutes and I'll be right back guys so they come out at 3 past 4 something like that and yeah okay guys for these next 12 minutes or 9 minutes now I think I'm going to be cutting up an apple and eating this so it wastes time because I can't pause the camera if you didn't know so I'm just going to cut yeah, up. so I'm going to cut up the apple now to waste time the reason I came upstairs is because my um, stepmom came around and there's going to be noise. And there's noise now because of my brother. Keep that back now. Just like that. <laughs> okay. okay, so if you don't know how to cut up an apple, just cut each side. And then once you've got that, Cut it down the centre from each bit you've cut and cut it into little slices. I cut mine up tiny so yeah it's much easier. Or if they're bigger like this one you can cut them into three. Um. I hope this iPad don't die. Let me quickly check how much charge. It has got 43%. It's been on charge since last night, so that's good. And I've been on it all day, non-stop. That's good. All thanks to my dad. He bought it for me. Well, I didn't buy it. He got it for his upgrade. And he gave it to me and my brother, so that's good. Because my dad is the best. Okay, now you're just gonna have to sit here and watch me. My hands smell like cinnamon.
And guys, if you're younger than like seven, eight, and you're not responsible to use a knife, then don't use one and get your mum to cut it up, just to make sure you don't cut yourself. I'll be back once I've cleared the plate. I know I said I'll come back once the plate's cleared, but we've only got five minutes left. Till they come out. I'm gonna go downstairs and put my rubbish in the bin and stuff. Okay, so they come out in like 30 seconds, 10 seconds, I don't know. So I'm gonna take them out in a minute. Now I take them out. They're not done. Yes, they are. They're I put them in 12 minutes. Doesn't matter. They're not She's done She's recording. Yet. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do that all again, Frank. Nah, they're not okay, done yet. So I have to keep them in. Yeah, but you just got in her video. She's recording. You big okay, so now I have to wait for another like five minutes, I'll be back. No, Frank. Okay, so there's only like one minute, two minutes left. I don't know, I can't be bothered to count anymore. Okay, sorry about that. My nan walked past and I didn't want to get her face in or anything, you know. This is dirty as hell. Check it now, stand back. Well, all the others are brown except for two. Check. check if these are done. Nan, check if they're done. There's only two that are white or three. Look. They done? Yeah, they're done. Okay, so. Let them cool down there, turn the oven. Ah, burnt myself on this button. Okay, so guys, I'm gonna let them cool down for like two seconds, and then oh, about five minutes. two seconds to them, whatever, and then um, put them on the plate right now. Let's put them on the plate, guys. Let's put them on the plate. <laughs> Can I use these to pick them up? No, they don't get stuck. So I'm going to scrape them up and put them onto the plate. This takes quick as puff pastry does stick. But to you, you never know. So I'm going to make the nice pattern so everybody can enjoy and then I'll, yeah, I feel dizzy doing this. I'll be right back once I've plated them. Okay guys, so they're done, they're plated, let me show you. Look nice. And yeah, now I'm going to take them out for them to eat and we'll see if they like. Has she got kids? Do 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 do! Why am I glowing? They're good, aren't they? I can't even out. I've just eaten a savoury one. I'll eat one later. They look really good. Hey. Let them cool down. Frank, you're so disabled. They'll taste better when they're cooled down. No, they don't. 
can leave, they taste nice hot. So you have to stay now. I'm going to go, guys. Bye.